With the next generation of consoles on the horizon, is 2019 the best or worst time to pick up a new console? So I have here a PS4 Pro that I recently picked up from GameStop and I uh, used uh, their special that they had going on for an additional boost in trade credit so that helped to cut down the cost a bit and I'm excited to open this up here and show you what's inside the box also give you my first impressions and show a little bit of gameplay so sit back and enjoy some of the unboxing of the PS4 Pro First time PS4 owner here and so far everything has been a breeze to set up. I really enjoyed the elegant background music and the dashboard is very clean and simple to use. Like the console's matte finish and footprint, it's, it's not too large and it almost seems like a three-tiered intergalactic sausage patty that made by the likes of Thor. Now the controller is also very interesting. It has this LED light on the back of it and uh, I like that the the batteries are already built in kind of like the pro controller on the Nintendo Switch and so that's kind of cool instead of like the two AA batteries from the Xbox controller. Now it is a little bit different than the Xbox and Nintendo controllers so it took a tiny bit of getting used to but I almost feel like it's a, a little bit more precise and so it might be built for uh, first person shooter type games. I'm, I'm not sure. It could be pretty versatile. I got to try it on Doom here and so let's get into some gameplay and show you how it looks.
I've been impressed with the performance so far. It, I didn't see any lag or any sort of slowdowns in the gameplay and I have the super sampling mode set on the console currently. I'm using a 1080p TV. I don't have it on a 4K television at the moment and so uh, there is an additional boost that you can get even if you have a 1080p television so I think that's kind of cool. I, I believe the Xbox One X also does the same thing. But the detail is very nice, the gameplay is very smooth, and so I had no issues with performance. And I, I think this is going to be a great fit for me. This is the only game I got to test it on, but let me know in the comments below what you think about the PlayStation 4 Pro. Are you considering getting a console in 2019, or are you going to be waiting for the next generation? I appreciate you following along here, I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content like this, and stay tuned for the next one.